Yeah, that's me picking the bar tab up again. Anyway, Kim Woodburn, welcome to Hello. our program. Hello. What did you make of uh, those who protested at the funeral on Wednesday? I think anyone that has any protest at a funeral is absolutely gross. You don't take a protest to a funeral. You respect, you respect, you respect. But it was a public funeral. It wasn't a private funeral. It was going through the heart of our capital. It was being paid for, in part, by the British taxpayer. So I guess in a free society, provided it's done with a certain restraint that doesn't intrude on the family, uh, protest is not entirely out of order, is it? At a funeral, it certainly is. It Even doesn't though, belong as at I've a funeral. It. it doesn't belong at a funeral. It's Oops. totally wrong. Somebody but, has died. But it was the funeral of not the head of state, which is non-political. It was the, the, the funeral of a prime minister. And by definition, prime ministers are political. And no prime minister has always, has always had the support of all the country. People will have different views. But we live in a democracy. You can hate something. You can love something. But you, vo you voice your opinion, but you, do, you don't go parading around a funeral. That's just simply not fair. You're spoiling the enjoyment of people that liked Maggie Thatcher and wanted to see her buried in a polite, dignified way. So in your view, the people who uh, were unhappy about this funeral and the manner of it, they should just have stayed away? Well, of course. You can have your say, but you don't go to a funeral and try to spoil it for others. But You're it, taking it, away a... Per if you liked Maggie Thatcher and you disliked her, what right are the people that disliked her mm got to force the people that liked her to put up with them at a funeral. But didn't the protest, the protest didn't disrupt the funeral. I mean, you could say that the protests themselves were done in quite a, a dignified way. But I think the only reason they were done in a dignified way is because the security was second to none. That's and I think they realised they were on a hiding to nothing if they started something. What did you think of the protest, Jackie? Well, I thought the protest which involved people turning their backs silently was, in my opinion, actually pretty legitimate and quite decorous uh, and you know whilst on the whole I would agree with Kim that you don't go to a funeral to protest I think the point you you make Andrew is absolutely right this was a funeral that 10 million pounds worth of public money had been spent on yeah. I think that's okay the 10 million figure I should say is, a, is has the makings of a propaganda figure it may include the salaries of the police who would already have been on duty yeah anyway. okay fair but it was a, a lot of money but it was, it was a money. but the point was it was a public funeral I think it was whole, I, I don't incidentally think it was right to chant for some of the reasons that Kim suggested. And incidentally, I thought the Ding Dong, the Witch is Dead um, campaign was misogynist at mm. uh, best and pretty offensive, actually. So that, I think, definitely went too far. But this it was a woman who by design created strong feelings. It isn't the case that everybody in the country supported her. People did have strong feelings and where, if it was possible to do it in a decorous way by turning your back, I think that that was a reasonable thing. Do you think that's childish? I you go all that way there because you're going to turn your back. Stupid prats. <laughs> what is going on? I'm an adult. I must turn my back. You big Prannies, don't be so ridiculous. <laughs> What's but a no, prannies? Don't ask. People don't chose ask. to go. People chose to go all the way there to stand by the side of the street and hold banners and things like that. Yes, that's fine. They it felt isn't. strongly. They felt it strongly. Isn't. But did you not? If, you, if I dislike positive. somebody, if I no, dislike no, no, I mean, somebody they, so they much, positive I wouldn't banners, go anywhere is what near I mean. them. But people travelled there and they held, you know, I love Maggie banners and oh. they held flowers and yes. things like that. Yes, yes, that's rather a nice sentiment, isn't it? I love that. That was a nice sentiment. They belonged at the funeral. But not this nonsense with these banners turning their backs. What have, we come, to, what have we come to turning in this your country? Back. is neutral between love and hate. Turning your back, it seems to me, is a uh, quietly respectful way to say, actually, no, I don't. This isn't Why are the you whole of the British at public. A funeral? The whole of the British public. Because otherwise, all you would have seen would have been crowds of people and you, the impression you digitally, they You digitally turned your back, didn't you? By I not suppose watching. I did, yeah. I, I did digitally but turn my back. why did you watch a woman? You couldn't stomach. I didn't watch it. No, she That's didn't That's the point. I didn't watch it. She didn't watch, I, watch it. If I didn't like somebody, I'd say to her, I couldn't stand that flaming woman. I wouldn't even bother getting on a bus to go to that woman's funeral. You're just being an absolute dope. Michael, you look there, silly uh, and you okay. are silly. I, 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 are you anything useful to add to this? Well, I <laughs> thought there was a net increase in British decorum this week. I thought there was a substantial reaction against the people who'd been protesting in the days before the funeral. 
One of the reasons why, I think in the end, very few people did turn up and protest at the funeral, I think the media has given more coverage probably than the very small number of protests uh, mer merited. I think people were shocked by it, and the protesters, I think, backed off. I think they uh, were cowed into not doing I think they were cowed into not doing And um, I think, you know, around the world, uh, the British have emerged as pretty decorous from the whole event. I think British decency uh, ruled the day. Are we showing more decorum in general these days, or are we descending into barbarianism? Oh, we're turning into barbarians. Of course we are. Yeah. The man is... Okay. Like, oh, come along now. You think, you think that charge of the witch is dead? It's vile and oh, putrid. I hate it. No, I hate it. And what about... Have you ever thought about this? this would some, be of these, some of these idiots have got young children at home watching them behave like this. Now, I, now it's appalling, you know. They've okay. got children, they've got brothers, sisters, mums, dads, watching them behave like that at a funeral. Right. They should and be ashamed of themselves. We've run out of time, but we think we like strong opinions on this programme. Oh, they're... Helps to keep us awake at this time of night. Anyway, that's your lot for tonight, but not...